until the president has left the program then. One at a time. So, what's, what's the first question? President Carlo Catigbac has apologized to you if you were offended over the airing of a controversial political ad. Are you accepting the apology of the ACS? Well, tao nang rin ako. So, alam mo, I have kept a healthy distance from... Uh, it's now in that they are deliberating in Congress, the lower house and the Senate uh, there is uh, a plan that they would uh, pass a joint resolution or something. But fundamentally, really, ang decision na sa House ngayon. Not so much of the Senate because uh, the Constitution says all of these things must originate from the lower house. Yan ang ano. Forget about all this uh, hula balu. Uh, ang ano yan, nandyan sa house. The critical move is in the house. And I tell you, I am not going to interfere. Wala talaga ako. Kung, mani kung maniwala kayo, okay. Kung hindi, but, but those who knows me, who know me, alam nila. No, I said I leave it to Congress. How about the apologies, sir? Are you accepting the apologies? Yes, uh, I accept the apology, of course. So, sir, will you also accept the 2.6 million on the Ash Wednesday? Why is that a crop? Cross, sir. Sir, will you accept the 2.6 million na uh, isinusole ng ABS-CBN? Ito daw po kasi yung... Eh, bigyan na lang nila sa any charitable uh, institution of, of the choice. Sir, now that they apologize, are you keen on telling um, Soljen Galida of para uh, i-address, sir, yung kuwaran to petition? Ang problema kasi nitong uh, sa Soljen... Once he makes an official statement that there is a violation of law, then stop na ako. Parang stop ako. Hindi na ako makagalaw. I cannot tell him stop. The sergeant can always announce that there is a violation of law and that he, he is going to investigate it. Wala na akong mga... Hindi ko masabi yan. Do not do it. Stop it. Yan ang problema sa soldier. The soldier does not clear with me, unlike the Secretary of Justice. He will call my attention, or he will bring it up, in the Senate, uh, in, in the cabinet. Ang soldier in there. He studies and he goes to the public and say, there is a violation here. Hindi ko na mapigil yan. Otherwise, alam mo, kung sabi mo may tao may kasalanan or there's uh, a violation or any uh, whatever that does not uh, in consonance with law, wala talaga kung yan ang iba ang opisina ng soldier kaysa secretary of justice. Ang soldier mismo if he makes an announcement during his uh, office hours, yung ulo ni ma'am, may, may cross pa naman. <laughs> sir, other topic, sir. Meron na po kayong desisyon kay uh, Commissioner Morente po. Morente po. Immigration Commission. 
I think this is going to be an investigation by Congress. Uh, uh, I, I defer to Congress first before I make any uh, decision. Uh, ano, para walang sabi na ano. Kung ano man sabihin niya, nandyan siya at he tells the story from where he stands. So mananatili po siya sa kanyang posisyon sa ngayon? Wala, wala akong gawin. Not, not yet. Not, not after the investigation. But I think the Secretary of Justice uh, is also doing his uh, homework. At kung sino lang mauna. But at least there is somebody who tell me that uh, these are the things that uh, should not happen or should have happened. Sir, dismayado po ba kayo dun sa pastillas ka? Dismayado ba? Pastillas. Yung ano, I am insisting on the ouster of all who are connected. I think we have uh, terminated, uh, but there will be more. I think uh, the, meron atang napaalis na. But they should, they should be replaced, all of them. Uh, uh, and I am for the... I am asking the commissioner of uh, the civil service na to give me a list of uh, uh, first grade nung nakapasa or those who have uh, uh, good records scholastically sa academic, eh, pwede niyang pera ng pangalan. I will replace almost all of them yung nasa post ko. Sir, may plano po ba kayo i-review ang POGO policy? I-review ang pagpasok ng mga POGO policy? I will wait for uh, uh, this thing to uh, settle down. I will not uh, investigate when there's a flurry of, uh, you know, uh, actions being taken here and there. Uh, and also with uh, the investigation of China. It, it would be prudent for me, I think, to just uh, wait. Sir, have you directed for this uh, African swine fever? Because I understand you had a meeting yesterday. Yes, uh, we, uh, I asked the Secretary of uh, Agriculture to come up with a protocol uh, how to control, for example, uh, pag uh, lumabas yan in uh, those who are uh, declared freed of the swine uh, flu, uh, matatakan talaga so that they can travel. Kasi yung iba ayaw pa ipadaan eh. They do not allow uh, the, the cargoes of uh, the pork meat to, to pass the well, uh, highways uh, that traverse uh, the, the local government unit. Magulo yan. So, so kung may tatak na, yung wala, at nairoon pa yung swine uh, fever, di wag na muna. Sir, yung travel ban sa South Korea kanina, will you expand because of COVID-19? Hindi kita nga nakuha mo. Yung COVID-19, sir. Ah. Uh, kanina yung corona na lang. Opo, yung corona. Will you expand yung travel ban? Kasi kasak meron na. Ban? Opo. No, I cannot do that. No country can do that. If, it, if the guy is healthy, why would you... Uh, you cannot do that. There, there cannot be a total travel ban and uh, you do not allow anybody to enter the... You are going to lock down the entire Philippines for that. It, 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 it ain't that way. And for those who are healthy, they should come in. And for those who have been identified from other countries, then that is the time that we can raise the objection of his entry. But all the previous, uh, or cured, and they have passed the 14 days, 15 days uh, uh, 
uh, ano ito, uh, sequestration. Okay naman siguro. But me personally, if you ask me, my answer now is I cannot do it. I will not allow yung travel. Sir, yung sa Hong Kong and Macau, what are your plans? Hong Kong and Macau and China. My plans about what? Uh, I will leave it to the DOH and uh, the guys uh, who are in charge of it, whether it would be safe or not to do it. I am not a medical person. I'm a lawyer. So what a lawyer should do before making any decision is really to consult the expert. The expert in this case is the DOH. Uh, hi, sir. Good evening, po. Yung uh, sa pagkamatay po ng mother ni... Where are you? Sir, sa anak po. Uh, regarding dun sa pagkamatay ng mother ni Vice President Lenny Robedo, uh, kayo po ba ipupunta sa wake po niyang, niya, Hindi sir? Po, I never read time. I just came in from Davao, uh, but I, I sent uh, my... I conveyed my condolences. And... Uh, well, the flowers, pasaliman sa kultura natin, we do it uh, with flowers. Ah, let's post, sir. Na, nakausap niyo ba ba sa personally or through phone? I know. But uh, I'd like to say now that uh, I am sad I, and I share his grief. I also lost the father once upon a time. Are you now keen on supporting its renewal? No, I don't know. 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 I and you can ask anybody. And if there is a congressman would say, no, no, if it is true, I will resign. I never, never, never really called anybody about this, even before. Wala akong kinausap na tao dito. Uh, I will cross the bridge when I am there. Maybe I will call the media to help me out. It's, it, it would be a difficult decision, really. So I will... Okay, thank you, I'll Mayor. cross the bridge when I'm there. Thank you, thank you very much. Thank you, Mayor. Thank, thank you, Mayor. Thank you, Mayor. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, Mayor. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Sir, pumalik si Ina sa Christia. Hi, sir. Good evening po. I'm Christia Fox from CNN Philippines. I also covered you, sir, before during the campaign. Reliever po kay Ina. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you.